Good Monday morning, everybody. I'm meteorologist Brett Luna. We have seen a few showers and a few strong thunderstorms moving through parts of the Delta overnight. There was one severe thunderstorm warning issued, and that was for northern Bolivar County and northern Sunflower County. That was issued at about 3.30 this morning, and it expired at about 4 o'clock this morning. So other than that, no severe thunderstorm warnings for our viewing area. However, we are in a dense fog advisory, so everybody in that gray color that's popping up, that's everybody but Deshea County, Arkansas, and our far northern counties. Everybody else, dense fog advisory until 10 o'clock this morning. So if you are having to get out on the roads this morning, you can expect visibilities of less than a fourth of a mile in spot. So just be sure to take it safe traveling this morning. We're in the mid 50s in Clarksdale, 54 right now, 57 in Greenville, 58 in Greenwood. The further south you go, temperatures are in the low 60s, 62 for Vicksburg, 64 down in Jackson. And then over here in the northeastern part of the state, not too much of a difference this morning. 59 for Starkville and 56 in Tupelo. So we have seen a few showers and a few thunderstorms overnight. And then as we go throughout the morning, we may still see a few isolated showers during the morning time. Not really expecting any thunderstorm activity this morning. Once we get closer to the afternoon, though, things will begin to change just a little bit. Futurecast has some of these thunderstorms developing back a little bit further west of I-55. However, I think most of the activity by about 1 o'clock should be along I-55. That's where if we do see any thunderstorm development, it should be closer to I-55. And then moving on just a couple more hours, that will continue to move off on that easterly track. So by 2 o'clock, a little bit east of I-55, 3 o'clock, we are still expecting some heavy showers, strong thunderstorms, possibly even some severe thunderstorms moving through the northeastern part of the state and the eastern part of the state. And that will continue to keep on moving east on up in the parts of northern Alabama and central Tennessee. And that's just going to continue on that track and stay in out of our area, though, during the rest of the day. So really the best chance for any thunderstorm activity, that's going to be the further east you go in the state for today. There's a chance for some light showers tomorrow, but that's about all we're going to see for tomorrow. Very warm day for us, upper 70s for the afternoon temperature, 77 at 2 o'clock, 79 by 4, otherwise mostly cloudy. It will be a little bit breezy though with southwesterly winds coming in at 10 to 15 miles an hour during the afternoon. And we could see some gusts reaching up to 20 to 25 miles an hour. 48 for the low temperature tonight, mostly cloudy skies, west southwesterly winds at 10 to 15 miles an hour for tomorrow. We're going to see high temperatures drop quite a bit from today. 58 for the high tomorrow, mostly cloudy. It will be another breezy day for us with northwesterly winds at 10 to 15 miles an hour tomorrow. Over the next seven days, we are going to start to dry out a little bit more on Wednesday, mostly sunny, 62. Thursday, upper 60s, mostly sunny. Friday, mostly cloudy. However, temperatures in the mid-70s before a rain chance coming in this weekend.